Hello, Species Value Nature System. I said pastrami sandwich. We do. Put the the pastrami in a, in tin foil. Put it in the um. And then put like cheese on top of it, and then wrap the tin foil and let it sit in the pan. It's not going to burn to the pan because it's in the tin foil. And the and the heat stays in there because the tin foil is closed and it gets all warm, professional, just like the the people. If you went to go order a a, a pastrami at a at a, a delicatessen in Delhi or whatever. Now there's a there's a um, there's a whole bunch of people in my, from my town associated with courts. And with judges, fa extended family members, and stuff like that, with crime rules through time, with criminal justice and with foreign police. And that was exploited for trade center crimes. It was also, they used to, to cover up the trade center crimes, child predators, and life progression cover ups. Because they used people, when I, in my grade when I was younger, for evidence crimes, witness fabrication crimes. They had them pretended associated with me when I didn't have anything to do with them. And then after they graduated high school, people associated with Trinity College and, and, and with CCSU, they were directed to pretend like I knew them before that. And that was was is recorded tied to their, their active roles, inherent active and progressive roles with further child predators brought up to me by, through untimely death confessions. They also affected a pattern of confessions to me, connected every year of my life, intercity, connected to houses in my area with all these people tied, and to relatives to them, tied to them, and people I, I, I never had anything to do with in my high school. They used to be friends with uh, my neighbor, Ray Kalal, and his cousin. I never had anything to do with him and his cousin, and his other cousin, Subby Scalora. Uh, Carla Greca says he's... Uh, Involved with agencies. Online, she said that. Also involved with, with they attached me to fake conversations about agencies. He, you know, she says he's in the CIA. I never, and he also has evidence crime rules since I was a kid. I have it recorded with, with drug dealing through the schools used to keep the um, school, school security guards using that. And, and when they're keeping it for polarity, they're putting placements. In, in people's classrooms that are going to move on to uh, ties to courts that are drug clicks. They're evidence predators. There's a Christine Tardet, Christine Bedard, recorded and confessed being used with F WFSB and with Fox CT and with other Connecticut media criminally, with child predators, spreading rumors with them, with physical delusions recorded in the media. Then the media won't correct that. There's a Dave KNERR. And E.R. Eric K N E R also recorded and confessed with curs and with others, child predators with a, with a victim victims advocates even in the court and with judges through time. I had to write a complaint about a judge Smith when I was a kid tied to this. There's also a a Dave, a Dave Smith and his mother recorded and confessed involved with some child predators and I, and, and that person I think is on the uh, child predator list. And she used to be the uh, the police dispatcher. And then we have other FBI and, and other agencies involved with the roles in state police and, and a MPs recorded in the fest involved with database illusion stacking roles. So if, if you sp spread a rumor about it, someone, that's one thing. But if you do it because you're covering live progressions, because you pretended past history is tied to the people and stuff like that, that's another thing. You know what I mean? These are predators with, with New Britain Superior Court, uh, Justin Kavinskis, with other campus ties with with uh, MP families criminally involved, MPO Floyd, forging names with them, switching sequences with them, using Facebook to direct illusions to, and then pretend that's evidences. Weathersfield Police using their page, Facebook page, recorded using their Facebook page to hide child sex predator proven with a school. And recorded tied to the other proven ones already. And their family members further recorded and confessed of volatile crimes with uh, with doctors, with their patients too, with uh, involved, with the mother of one. 
and, and with the <clears throat> houses next to uh, High Crest School, like a, a Pierce. I never had anything to do with a Pierce. I had like one to hello to Matt Pierce when I was a kid. I never had anything to do with him. Tied to the, the one with the mother. The, the, mo his mother associated with doctors, with drug clicks next to school. Also, Fred Grise recorded and confessed involved with the houses in my area, with child parties, with the police, and with criminal justice clicks, with doctors, and with like overt drugs and stuff like that. Evidence crimes through time. I forgot what I was going to say. But in other words, there's all these people that tie it to my neighbor's house and to his cousins that pretended they knew me, to even to my my, my mother. A, a Phil Clough went to go do business with my mother in real estate before, and then she didn't want to do him because he was like weird. He was like rude. You know what I'm saying? He said he was a friend of mine. Everyone knows that we were never friends. I only they used to just make confessions. They the first time they they, they had a kid. Uh, I don't even know his name. Bayrock, a, a a black kid. Never saw him before my life. I when I came around the corner, they had him attack me. And then I never saw him again in my life, except for after at a, at a golf course that night. They told me to go there. Also, that golf course recorded and confessed involved with. Crimes of courts, with police associated with the with, with the hospitals and with forensics places. Also, that forensic there's a forensic place in the news now. We had all kind of people fired and stuff like that for them. Of uh, Phil Clow, the relative of my neighbor, also police forms associated them with them with evidence crimes. Federal criminals, and cases with them. Also, federal criminals associated who were co-defendants of former director of the FBI, Robert Luskin, recorded and involved with Weathersfield and intercity police with crimes with, with the Kalala family and with their extended families. Uh, and also with foreign, with the NAS foreign police. Also, a Claudia Scalora and <clears throat> others recorded and confessed on off-campus crime roles directed to them by investigators. Associated also with new with um, what's it called? Nordstrom's West Farms Mall. They have like internation police, homeland. They have nurse nuns and stuff like that. Like Eric Jensen also recorded and confessed involved with federal criminals, with courts, and with federal criminals. Proven. And like he went, he lived in another city, and then they had him go, go in my classroom. They had a Christine Tardet with a court. They had her go in my classroom with a John Mayano, who she went to the mall, uh, the, the prom with. John Mayano, his brother, is criminally involved. Alex Mayano keeps pretending he had he had something. I met him one time in life. He, he called me because he wanted to go to a boxing gym. Also recording and confessed involved with their roles with, Jim, with Sammy Vega and with other child predators with like religious and like doctors and drug clicks with the kids. Also, uh, some people use the name um, Joey Quest, pretending to know me through time, with the police forms involved with the golf courses, and with the uh, intercity, intercity. Also with the uh, police chief's family, uh, um, Mazzucato. I never had anything to do with them. They're also recording and confessed involved with the uh, Weathersfield Police, attaching my name to fake things. Then they they, they promote these people. Also recorded and confessed, and then you can't get you, you can't get a response from someone because they keep attaching me to fake conversations. You see what I'm saying? They did that. They attached me to fake conversation in relationship to, to to Alicia's. These are girls who are, who are recorded and confessed involved with court police on you know on off campuses directing evidence crimes, witness fabrication mistakes purposely, purposely. These are interstate too. Tight in, in New York City, on off Trinity campus, CCSU, and other campuses connected through time. So we have child predators with my neighbors. My new neighbors, my old neighbors connected to the same Dylan family, recorded and confessed involved with tri crimes of kids since I, he was a kid, since I was a kid. Making strangers come up to me with confessions, also recorded, also. Affidavit about a kid I never met before. 
calling me on the phone to make because because he, he he was he was being directed to make uh, evidence crimes when he was a little kid he didn't want to make then that was exploited the two times he called me up as an adult because he wanted to make confessions you know just to see him as long as I only really know this person from a handful of contacts Chris Chris Walters even he went to a private school but he lived next to my high school see these are people with the with the drug dealing around the high school connected also recorded connected to evidence crimes all kinds of cases serious and they're messing up my thing too because because I have to uh you know make who wants to hear about this with you two you know what I'm saying? We're gonna we're gonna have the uh, we have to have the police. People have no uh, no no right to have a badge when they're with rape threats and with sex crimes, with proven sex predators. Smith over there, and, and with people tie them time untimely deaths with the, with, with, with the grammar school. Then they, they then they have a racket where they pretend they don't understand people. I'm talking real clear. I'm talking about child sex crime acts, rape threats from the police. They hit that with sequence shifts. They hit that by pretending I harassed someone who called me and made confessions about his roles with child predators. And I was a principal that was put in jail reportedly for, for, for since then for taking pictures of girls in a, in a store. And, and, and those stores are recorded and confessed involved too through the Kerr family, a, a DeMauro police family and uh, uh, two Mendez brothers with detectives recorded and confessed involved with crimes with sex crime roles with the hallway of the courts and online with online policing of, of Facebook of New Britain Superior Court and with the Wethersfield Police Facebook page. They also pretended they knew me growing up just because they were my grade. The only time I know uh, Eric Mendez is from his roles in my KKK tied drug dealer videotaping him. Person didn't go to my school making confessions, demonstrations of his roles with criminality with Joe DeMora. And with his confessions about roles with crimes with a, with a uh, gold family back then, which is now connected to some some uh, federal criminals and investigate like private investigators. So, so they have rules with uh, crimes with with the Gold family. Uh, ILO family also recorded and confessed crimes with a, a Gold family. I never had anything to do with them. They had crime rules with kids and databases when I was a kid. Other mayors also recorded and confessed and involved. Also, Emmett is recorded and confessed and involved with Weathersfield schools. More on off campus with the uh, with the uh, grammar school. I mean, with the, what do you call it? The grammar school guys in jail. The, uh, with the middle school, the middle school, on and off campus with the middle school, also recorded and confessed tied to the relatives, extended relatives of my family, of my uh, neighbor, and with the new ones, and with the ones that left left out. They were they were like uh, uh, Ryan and Terry Kleza. Then they used the name Lewis, too, which is also a family uh, criminally involved with other things in the past. And they also have roles with untimely death and database illusion stacking with people on the campus of Trinity College. But I never had a conversation. I never had anything to do with those people. I had very, very brief, you know, like hello, like that, like things like that. Also, with their confessions, they make halfway confessions. I don't know, because in other words, I didn't live here for many years. I came back home. And then... Um, you know, now they're older and they're, they're hanging out with my, my other neighbor and stuff like that. And the other ones. So now they have all these police forms in the area. They have FBI, they have an FBI guy who has a mental doctor because he can't, he can't handle it. And those mental doctors are also recorded and confessed involved with the crimes with the kids. See, because they're using, pretending, because they have more credibility. Different police forms are with crimes with Weathersfield Police. They're switching names, forging names. They forge witness fabrications for the Trade Center. They have Harford Hospital they use for military investigations in, in wars. They use that criminally. They have drug crime roles with the Leahy family. Pretend they had conversations with me. All their friends trying to pretend they have conversations with me. Some Yagman family next to the high school recorded and confessed 
crimes with, with stacking databases with, with, with them and with, with, uh, with two Mendez brothers, detectives, and with, with a Joe DeMauro and with other people associated with my neighbors over here criminally through time. That's your mind.